Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you are doing good. So today I'm going to start with Git tutorial. So today I'm going to show you Git init that how you can initialize a Git repository. So let's get started. So let me just give you a basic overview of Git. So Git is basically a version control system. So it's basically, you know, keeping track of your files, whatever changes you are doing. Basically, it's a tracking kind of a thing. So to use git in your local, you can have git bash. So it is basically application for git command. So basically it provides a terminal where you can uh, run your git commands. So now let me show you documentation. So here you can see git in it. So it creates an empty git repository or reinitialize an existing one. So syntax of it is git in it. So with git in it, you can use several options that you can see here, dash q, quite is there, bear is there, template. So you can use these, you have, uh, you can also set the name of initial branch using initial branch option. So you can use multiple option, whichever your requirement is. So let me show you by doing this. So I have one uh, empty folder git tutorial and inside that I am going to initialize my git repository. So open terminal and in that write git in it. So if you are wondering how I can use git commands directly, I have already installed git bash in my system. So you can go to git bash and download and it will hardly take a minute to install it. So you can see it's a successfully initialized empty git repository. After that, it's giving the path of git repository. So git folder is by default hidden. So it's uh, not showing hidden folders. So let, so let me just change some preferences in my Visual Studio code. So now you can see git folder. So it basically installed uh, the basic necessities for git. So the main function of git in it is that you can create a new repository and you can also reinitialize existing path. So in this video, I have given you an overview of Git and Git Bash and Git init. So in my next video, I'll be showing you another command of Git that is Git add. So stay tuned and thank you so much for watching this video please like share and subscribe to my channel if you have any doubt then comment down in the comment section